Hi friends, this is your AI Nursar. Today I have come up with a new lesson on idioms and phrases. Today I have come up with a new lesson on idioms and phrases. This is your first sentence. Sojanya and Prakash are getting married. I heard it straight from the dash mouth. Sojanya and Prakash are getting married. I heard it straight from the dash mouth. Here are three options. Elephant's mouth, horse's mouth, camel's mouth. So your right answer is horse's mouth. The meaning of horse's mouth is you hear it from the person who has direct personal knowledge of it. Horse's mouth means you hear it from the person who has direct personal knowledge of it. So, Sojanya and Prakash are getting married. I heard it straight from the horse's mouth. I heard it straight from the horse's mouth. Here is your next sentence. I wanted to get together. I wanted the get together to be a secret. But my brother let the dash out of the bag. I wanted the get together to be a secret. But my brother let the dash out of the bag. Here are your three options. Dog, bird, cat. Dog, bird, cat. Your right answer is cat. To let the cat out of the bag. To let the cat out of the bag means to let a secret out in the open. The meaning of to let the cat out of the bag means to let a secret out in the open. So I wanted the get together to be a secret but my brother let the cat out of the bag. But my brother let the cat out of the bag. Here is your next sentence. The moment she started dash me up, I knew that she wanted to gain a favor. The moment she started dash me up, I knew that she wanted to gain a favor. Here are your three words. Pampering, barking, buttering. Pampering, barking, buttering. So the right word is buttering. The meaning of buttering somebody up means buttering somebody up means to praise or flatter someone excessively. Buttering somebody up means what? To praise or flatter someone excessively. So the right word is buttering. The moment she started buttering me up I knew that she wanted to gain a favor. The brothers are always pulling each other's dash. The brothers are always pulling each other's dash. In the bracket, you have these three words. Ear, leg, hand. Ear, leg, hand. The correct idiom is to pull each other's leg. The correct idiom is to pull each other's leg. The meaning is to tease or joke with someone often by trying to convince them of something untrue. The meaning of pulling leg means to tease or joke with someone often by trying to convince them of something untrue. So, the brothers are always pulling each other's leg. The brothers are always pulling each other's leg. Here is your next sentence. Don't trust him. He is a dash in the sheep's clothing. Don't trust him. He is a dash in the sheep's clothing. Wolf, fox, dog. Wolf, fox, dog. The correct word is wolf. Wolf in the sheep's clothing. 
wolf in the sheep's clothing means a person with a pleasant and friendly appearance that hides the fact that they are evil. The meaning of wolf in the sheep's clothing means a person with a pleasant and friendly appearance that hides the fact that they are evil. So the right word is wolf. Don't trust him. He is a wolf in the sheep's clothing. Next sentence. He won the race dash down. He won the race dash down. Hands, legs, head. Hands, legs, head. The correct word is hands down. The correct word is hands down. The meaning is to win very easily. Hands down means to win very easily. He won the race hands down. He won the race hands down. Here is your next sentence. By taking action against for your failure, you are just dash up the wrong tree. By taking action against for your failure, you are just dash up the wrong tree. Here are your three words. Cutting, peeling, barking. Cutting, peeling, barking. The meaning of barking up the wrong tree is trying to do something in a way that will not work. The meaning of the idiom barking up the wrong tree is trying to do something in a way that will not work. So your right sentence is by taking action against for your failure you are just barking up the wrong tree. Here is your next sentence. Don't try to make fun of him. Don't try to make fun of him. He dash off the handle pretty easily. He dash off the handle pretty easily. Here are your three words. Runs, flies, drives. Runs, flies, drives. Fly off. The meaning of fly off is lose one's temper. Lose one's temper. Fly off the handle. And T to lose one's temper. To fly off the handle means to lose one's temper. So don't try to make fun of him. He fly off the handle pretty easily. He fly off the handle pretty easily. Here is your next sentence. That laptop cost me dash. That laptop cost me dash. Here are your three phrases, an arm and a leg, an eye and an ear, a finger and a toe, an arm and a leg, an eye and an ear, a finger and a toe. The correct phrase is an arm and a leg, an arm and a leg. The meaning of this phrase is Use it to describe anything that is considered to be extremely expensive or excessively pricey. This idiom is used to describe anything that is considered to be extremely excessive or excessively pricey. This is your next sentence. I hate having to tell him what I really think of him. but. I have to dash the bullet, bullet now. I hate having to tell him what I really think of him. But I have to dash the bullet now. The three words are fire, bite, dodge. Fire, bite, dodge. The correct idiom is to bite the bullet. The correct idiom is to bite the bullet. The meaning is to force yourself 
to do something unpleasant or difficult to force yourself to do something unpleasant or difficult or to be brave in a difficult situation or to be brave in a difficult situation so i hate having to tell him what i really think of him but i have to bite the bullet now but i have to bite the bullet now here is your next sentence the indulgent um mother turns a dash to her son's faults the indulgent mother turns a dash to her son's faults here are your three phrases blinds i black i partial i blinds i black i partial i the correct idiom is to turn a blind i to turn a blind i meaning to ignore something that you know is wrong to turn a blind i means to ignore something that you know is wrong here is your next sentence the enemy was armed to the dash yet our soldiers managed to beat them the enemy was armed to the dash yet our soldiers managed to beat them teeth neck nose these are the three words teeth neck nose the correct word is the teeth arm to the teeth means well equipped or well prepared arm to teeth means well equipped or well prepared so the enemies was armed to the teeth yet our soldiers managed to beat them the enemy was armed to the teeth yet our soldiers managed to beat them